Welcome to another Transformers unboxing. Today we have, as you can see, the Decepticon Nemesis from Transformers Legacy Evolution. This, of course, is this year's Titan class. It barely fits in my light box. We're going to try to do this. Uh, we'll find out what happens. <laughs> um, so, looking at the box itself, we have the Ark, we have the Nemesis, we have some Seekers here, Coneheads, and uh, Thundercracker. We have, oddly enough, a Petrojet Skywarp. We have space, and I'm assuming that's Earth, because I don't see Cybertron. All right, let's see if I can flip this down here. All right, so we have product shot of the Nemesis, Legacy, and then we have a QR code over here where you can barely see this. This is a huge box. Uh, once we uh, get out of this on the side of the box, you know what? We're going uh, we're going freehand here. The side of the box we have a lovely shot of uh, the Nemesis in its robot mode, in her robot mode. Um, on the back, we have Nemesis, uh, you know, product shots, transformation. And then we have these little guys here. I didn't know about them. Oh, they come with it. Oh. I do almost no research on this beforehand. I like to go completely blind into this and be surprised. And, of course, on the opposite side, we have the artwork for Legacy Evolution. And then on the bottom... We have nothing but a little bit of legal. All right, we're gonna pop this guy right back in there. And we're gonna open this up. Might be seeing a little bit of this off screen. All right, uh, but. We will actually pause here. All right, the. Uh, Box is empty. That might be a little bit of a weird jump cut there. And there's how we're going to look at the Nemesis first thing. So let's see what comes in here. Usually it's pretty straightforward how to open these up. This one's a little weird. Nemesis obviously comes in vehicle mode. Okay, so open this up. We got some stuff in here. All right, so we have Nemesis Wings. Okay, and we have this box here, which shows... We're going to open it up, make sure there's nothing in there. There is nothing in there. Okay, that's garbage. All right, so we have those wings in here. Then we have this here. This is tissue paper. All right, this is probably going to be... Oh, they're on a sprue. Okay. Okay, that should be everything out of there. Making sure we're not losing anything. Here's the uh, here's some wings slash guns. There's the uh, tower. And then we have these little tiny... Uh, oh, number one, we have guns here. And then over here we have some tiny... Uh, what do they call these? Slugs. But they're all still on the sprue, like a, a model kit. That's pretty cool. And for your face, this is kind of how this is put together. How this is molded. All right. That there is empty, as you can see. So that is now garbage. Uh, next up, take away this. Oop, oop. Am I stacking something off there? Nope. All right, so that section there is empty. And for your information, I am this meticulous because I have accidentally thrown away some accessories in the past. There's the instructions. We'll set that over here. Um, now I think we can actually remove the nemesis from... Hey. It, 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 it's prison. This is, of course, a package, a uh, classic free package. 
There we go. All right, so that's free there. Set that off aside. And then this part of the wing, Nemesis is over glorified or basically overgrown Tetra Jet, kind of. All right, then we have that wing there. All right, so all that's left here in packaging is this part of the box. And that is garbage and empty. And now, the package is completely empty. Let's let's have a look at this. All right, so we come with some parts here. Um, this here looks like we're going to snap it into place right here. There's a little knobby here, knobby there. There's some peg in there. There we go. All right, so that uh, control tower pops in there. I, I opened it up a little bit when I was popping that out. That's some dust there. I thought it was going to be some uh, stress marks there. Uh, we're going to raise up to see what I'm doing here. So there is a gap here. All right there. We'll get to that then. Uh, this tower here plugs into there. I guess. Uh, we'll set those aside here. Oh, you know what? We need one of these. So we're going to pop one of these out. One of the guns. And we'll pop that in there first. There we go. Now we're looking right. All right. These pieces here. I wonder if there's a left and a right side. They look symmetrical to me. Classic feels cheaper on these. And that's the only way I can describe it. But they look like they're symmetrical, so I don't think it's going to matter. Which side? So we should just be able to pop those right into there. And there. All right. Now what we have here is facsimile of what the base looks like. There's lots of detail in this thing. Uh, we'll go hands-free again in a moment. Um, Now let's uh, pop on the rest of the guns here. And it looks like I might have used the wrong gun up here. It's probably one of these. I'm going to leave the slugs into, into place. Get these off. We're just going to use twisties. I do have some uh, Gundam tools. I don't know where they are right now. So we're going to pop that cockpit out. And we're going to take this. And we're gonna pop one of those in there. Oops. That uh, part's a little finicky with keeping it together, but we'll worry about that after we get it all assembled. And then that cockpit should fit in there like that, nice and neat. There we go. Now the top part here, set it on the side. We're gonna put these round guns. I guess that your preference could be anything. Okay, there we go. And these guys here look like they're going to go here on these sides. So we have her armored up. Excellent. And these are going to pop into the sides here. Move that up again. So it looks like there's a little peg in here. And we're just going to snap those in there.
Oh, they fit in there pretty loosely. I'll try this one on this side. I'm making sure this, this color part is facing upward toward the... Uh... The cockpit. And look, that has a stretch mark on it already. Is that... Hmm. Let me try something here, because I made stress marks there and there. These are wrong. There we go. They pop in right there. And unfortunately, I have a stress mark on the outside of mine now. But it is what it is. You can barely see it. You barely notice it. All right. So... There is the Nemesis assembled. It's already trying to transform, so there's some toler like one some more some tolerance issues. But as opposed to the uh, the Ark, it is not hollow looking at all. Got some thrusters back there. The most hollow part is right here, which well, I'm not gonna be upset about. Um, this is a solid, solid, uh, transformer. So there is the Nemesis transformed. All right. So we'll go hands free here and just have a look at the top. Going down, we have the guns, we have the canopy. We have that tower. This part here looks like it's, uh, once more tolerance issues. It wants to come apart. And it feels like it's made out of cheaper plastic than the rest. Right there. I'm not going to mess with that while I'm I have, a, I have it on handheld. But flip it down here. Look at all that detail. Beautiful detail. Beautiful coloring. And of course, you could set this up in like tower mode so we can have a Decepticon base. All right. So. I think we're going to end the video here and we'll do a separate one for transformation. I'm fine with that tolerance there, but that is the nemesis. <laughs> and that's what's in today's box. This is huge. Um, I will figure out how to do Titans right eventually. Um, but there's, we have the uh, slugs and the instructions. This, oddly enough, did not come with that garbage uh, thing. Maybe I doubt Hasbro is watching my videos saying that's garbage. But you never know. So anyway, there we go. There's a the nemesis. Thanks for watching. If you are still watching, hey, um, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If it helped you assemble it, let me know. Um, so you don't make the same mistakes as I made while unboxing it. But that way you didn't miss out on anything that, uh, you know, that was in the package. All right. Well, thank you for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you are not already a subscriber. Share this video with your friends so they know how to assemble their, their nemesis. Um, or they need help with it. And uh, I'll be coming out with another video where I'm transforming her. As always, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.